snoozy? Uh, snoozy? Oh, you're making me an offer I can't refuse, sir. Molto bene. È eh, molto bene. Ah, sì, sì. Hi guys. Uh, yeah, just gonna try to do this uh, vlog here. Um, me and Frederick's trip. Frederick there is snoozing as usual. What are you snoozing today, Frederick? The one and only. Your favorite, is it? Yeah. Good stuff. So basically, what we're doing here is we're on our way from. Uh, uh, Brussels, Midi, whatever, yeah, Brussels to Lille in France. I think we just, uh, that should be France there, I think. Pretty bad weather today. Uh, we're gonna see Neil Young tonight, so, uh, so we've done that. I think, is it the fourth year in a row? Yeah, it is. I think we've pretty much um, gone a bit mental there just doing Neil all the time. So, but yeah, we'll uh, start in Lille tonight, and then tomorrow we are heading. Uh, to Sicily, so I'll film some there. Should be some nice scenery for you guys. I'll talk, talk a bit about snooze and anything really. So yeah, what you see here is two thirty-somethings, very young guys, who happen to turn forty. I guess are we turning forty? That's a bit annoying, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah, we're turning. Both of us, actually, both of us are turning forty uh, during this trip so we got some nice cigars mm -hmm. for uh, uh, the 40th your celebration so Frederick he's turning he's gonna be 40 and I'm gonna Before be you. I'm gonna be in my 30s when you're 40 Damn it. yeah so that's I look forward to that one yeah um, yeah so we'll just keep filming around here show you guys some things um, you might see a few seconds of Neil that's the next thing coming up we get uh, Neil Young playing in Lille tonight. See you So yeah, Neil was absolutely fantastic yesterday. I thought he was better than in London, actually. If uh, if I have half of his strength and energy when I'm turning 40 as he has when he's 70, that would be awesome. So today we're a little bit uh, worse for wear, but uh, this could sort it out. And uh, as you saw here, got some good snooze, always. So we're in a, we're in a brasserie in uh, Lille, France. And it's raining outside, but I'm still wearing shorts and t-shirt because I don't have much else. But tonight we're going to Sicily, so that's when it's going to be hot and humid. So hopefully this is the last of cold weather. So <laughs> it's the first time we can chill actually, isn't it? Like it is. it's, been, it's been crazy just going from A to B all the time. And then after the concert we had a few great Belgian, Belgian beers. Belgian beers. So, um, One or yeah. two. Well, that's what you can call, I don't know, strong, but good. Strong but good, um, yeah. What, today I'm on the Afligem, I think, which is another solid Belgian beer, because we're, we're on the border, we're really close to Belgium here. Just had a steak, uh, some blue cheese, uh, you had some shallots with yours. Yes. So we're feeling a bit better, so uh, I guess I'll see you, we'll see you in Sicily next time, with more snooze, of course. Bye. Cheers. It's our accommodation in Trapani, Sicily. I'm gonna sort the passport no, out. Wine.
what sort of water is that? Where are we? Oh, that's the Mediterranean. That, yes. Mediterranean. The Mediterranean. Uh, weather, good enough for me, good enough for you. It's really good and it's just going to get better. Oh yeah. Yep. It's time for some snooze. Snooze time. I haven't tried that yet, so this is. Oh, maybe this is your first time then. Oh, let's let's film this. Let's do this. Let's do this. I'll take the camera. Do you take the camera? Am I going to review this though? Because I don't even know. Is this is this an official review? Oops. Uh, uh, is it? No. I do. I do apologize. My eyes are fucked. Sorry, but it's uh, hay fever here. So today we have. I don't know if this is a review or not. Crafted Carter's Highland Single Cut, blended by Connie Anderson, since 1864. I don't think he's blended it since 1864. <laughs> Not that old, Connie, is he? You never know. So. You never know. So we are basically we are in outside Trapani in on Sicily. Okay. Right. Okay. What about smell? You haven't yeah, smelled no, it. Yeah, no. But I can taste it. Yeah. It's nice. Uh, Ah, that's really rich. Darker f from the tobacco, I would say, than, than the portion. Because mm -hmm. the portion is, at least now I tried it, it's really, really moist, the portion. Extremely moist, which is good if you, you want that kind of whiskey kick. Right. So it's really focusing on the whiskey. Here, you got a more of a... The whiskey is a bit more subtle, but the tobacco is darker. So it's kind of... I almost a bit chocolatey. I actually prefer the the smell of this to the portion because I'm not a huge whiskey drinker. Feel it. So today we're going we're going to Eris and then up northern coast past Palermo. Yes. Uh, ending up in Bagheria. We stay the night. Uh, so a bit of Sicily today. We're going to film some for you. Okay. <laughs> see, you, see you soon, guys. Okay. Check it out. We are on the way up to Eris. Right. On the still Sicily. We're gonna be in Sicily for a week now, so should be some nice scenery. Hold on, Hold on. here we go. And um, snooze of the day in. Uh, I'm having um Mira portion actually. Frederick is snoozing. Onyx. Onyx is From general. Yeah. So it's good good snooze. General. Good snooze, good view. Uh, good company, good snooze. You are driving slightly too fast, but I think it's more likely that the Italian police will stop us because we're driving too slowly. <laughs> it's probably <laughs> probably what's happening here. At least it's not bad traffic. So yeah, so we're gonna go up to Eris. Well, actually the uh, uh, Eris Antique, I think it's called. Antique. It's, it's the old, old Eris. Yeah. So, you know, we've both been on sort of Grand Canaria and places like that. This is still rugged, but uh, still got, you know, some flowers, trees, uh, and especially the, the buildings are much nicer here. You don't get those concrete blocks. You get really old school, traditional European um, style buildings, you know, that we don't really get them in Sweden or England. They, well, England has a different type, but I love these Italian buildings. So I'm probably going to start my uh, review of uh, Rapia Lingon, Lingonberry up in Eris and quite possibly have a beer as well. <laughs> See you up there. Right. Hello. Cow on the road. Cow on the road. There's no cow on the road. It's on a, the ice. It's a, it's a Swedish expression, but I don't think that's what it's meant. Another one. Uh-oh. Well, hello there. Ooh. This is, uh, reminds me of being in. Uh, uh, reminds me of being in Phu Quoc Island, uh, right. in Vietnam. We rented some motorbikes and just went, and literally just like loads of co uh, loads of cows on the motorway. Yes, <laughs> which was uh, interesting. So we had to slow down a bit there. Okay, so we're getting close to a race now, I believe. So no more cows, hopefully. <laughs> No words, guys. This is amazing. It's the entrance to Eris. Do you think they have beer? They do have wine. Oh, this is cool. Look at the view over there. Yeah, this is what we've been looking for. We've been kind of railing across northern Europe. Not, not as 
scenic. <laughs> this is amazing. Let's find some something to eat. Chill this, a bit. This is a, actually exactly what we want, right? Yeah, this is what we've been waiting for, you know. It feels like we've arrived. Check it out. Italy. Gotta love Italy. Maybe I'll buy a hat. Buy a hat? Yeah. Why not? Like that, like an old man's cap. Now you're turning, turning 40. You, you have one of these. I do. Well, you know, you gotta try to look your age. You know? This is like, I don't know, we could probably film some. I don't know, like maybe the Assassin's Creed would suit here. You can, you can climb. Pretty well, I think. You can climb it, can you? I like it. Okay, <laughs> let's go and see if we can find a restaurant. Should have some view. <laughs> Yeah. This is proper proper traveling. Oh. I'm glad to walk downstairs. It was a little bit hot. It's about it should be 32 degrees Celsius today. I think we're getting it's about 30 right now, isn't it? It should be. Yeah. So it's quite warm. This always happens when Frederick and I are traveling together. It just gets extremely hot wherever we go. New, New York last year was, one day it was about 34, 35. In Brooklyn, that was crazy because it's in the city and the underground was horrendous. And then we had one day in Rome three years ago, 37. Yeah. I think Germany was a little bit cool, but it also got pretty hot there. Rome was really bad. Yeah, Rome was bad. Venus, wine. Food bar. Sounds, right. good. Sounds good to me. Should we go down there? Let's have a look. Pizzeria, ristorante. Pizzeria. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's not Italian. Maybe, it's easy. Maybe not the best restaurant, but. I think I need to practice my Italian. No, we, we need some view. We can't. We're not sitting inside, are we? No. Uh, no. Okay. Menu. Frutti di mare. Frutti di mare. Cambero rosso. And pizzas. They're not expensive. Well, the main course. Are. Okay, let's find a place. The portions are 0 0.9 grams. So they're relatively large, but they are white. Uh, with still a little bit of moisture coming through. Uh, the nicotine is normal. It's uh, 8 milligrams per gram, or 7.2 milligrams per portion. Uh, it's got a Swedish match, not to catch it, as we used to sing. So it's, uh, it's one of the biggest brands from Swedish match. Shavin heard it! Gud, what a dark was. But it's a fort, too. We should speak English, really. Yeah. <laughs> Driving too fast. This is going on into Narnia. Coming out in Finland. I think we just got behind. Look at that car. Oh, nice. nice <laughs> is this Rambo's brother? B Bambo. Bambo. Bambi. An upside down Bambi. Here's. Come on. Spew some fumes. That was some proper fumes coming out of that one earlier, wasn't it? <laughs> Where are we? Alcamo, are we? Alcamo. So we're. I think we're getting Alcamo. into Alcamo. Remember the Alcamo? <laughs> <laughs> so it's basically. Uh, it's a town that it should have the best wines of Sicily. So we're going to pick a couple of bottles up for later, I think. Uh, so the the wine. We saw some. Uh, vines around here, like a wine region field, so it's uh, should be able to get some cool stuff. Hopefully, don't even know. Are we in Alcamo? Yeah, I think so. Yes. So our free GPS thought that this is the best way to the next town. <laughs> it uh, it doesn't even give us the um, the main road. So just try to get through Alcamo. Haven't found any wine yet, have we? Uh, but in it? I don't know. What's going on? Får man inte åka där? Jag vet inte. Um, ett sätt och residenti. Vad säger kartan? Uh, the map is saying okay. turn right in 35 meters. 
So probably out in the square or whatever it is. So we've been going around. I think we're going to go. Now it's now we're going to swing in here. 25 meters uh, uh, to the right. So it's, yeah, it's down there by the Vespa. Oh, is this even a, a road? This doesn't even look like it's possible to drive on. <laughs> That's it? There's no cars here. Uh -oh. Did you see any uh, forbidden? There's a wine bar. Yes, I think I saw that. Let's just. Uh, park here and get some wine. Oh, I think we need to <laughs> back up. We can't actually drive here, can no. we? Shit. Oh well, it looks nice. <laughs> turn right and then turn right. I don't know. Is that, can you go here? I think so. <laughs> okay, let's do this. This GPS is quite interesting. Let's do this. Ah, uh, okay. Right. Well, you got a wall here. Yeah. Um, back, reverse, reverse. Uh, yeah, you're fine. Fine. Just about. Yeah, but watch okay. it. Okay. 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 Yeah. Whoa. We're fine. Oh, uh, maybe. You're close, but yeah. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> down there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the GPS thought we should go down there. So yeah. maybe. I think we might right? have to. I don't know. No. I'm not sure. Just go. I mean, this, we need to change the setting on the GPS yeah. to go main roads. So I think because this is probably going like the scenic route or the, the you know the most dif no, difficult. Shut up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> just ignore her. Okay. Turning right. Maybe if we change the GPS voice to the surfer dude we had before. <laughs> maybe we should try we, that. Maybe, but he's probably more sort of like, yeah, Lister man, go down. Ah, I'm off. Okay. So, oh, that car. so if we survive Al Camo, we are going further towards um, Bagheria. Yes. No. Of course. No. Okay, we'll be back with you. <laughs> <laughs> See ya. See ya. Wine, finally. Unfortunately, not bottled. <laughs> I don't know, we couldn't find any bottles. Uh, I'm hoping that later, when we get to Palermo or Bagheria, that we could actually um, buy some wine from this region because it's not that far away anyway. But bizarrely, we couldn't really find any wine shops, which is weird. You should have been heard it. <laughs> Woohoo! Woohoo! And so we made it to Bagheria, which is on the north coast, isn't it? So on the north coast, yeah, north coast of Sicily, just east of uh, Palermo, which is, I think, the largest city uh, in uh, on Sicily. Uh, the, we're staying at a B&B, &B, and uh, they said there's about one million people in Palermo, so it's quite a big place. This is not as big, so it's just surrounded by mountains yeah hello and and this is the view from our terrace could not be happier about that over there i think around that area is palermo and the sun is about to set we're just deciding whether to to have a grill here, like uh, the owners of the place. It's a small B&B, they're only having four, four rooms. They're gonna do some barbecue uh, right over there. Might join that or go to a local restaurant. So we couldn't find any wine, but who needs wine when you got that? So this is basically what we just brought up here. So this is just to be on the safe side for today. So we have more with us. So I've got the Göteborg Serapia White Large Lingon, Crafted Snus Whiskey Original, General Macmira, a bit of an outsider here, the Anno 1852 Cognac Lus Snus. Got the Mustang Lus, Mustang Lus, uh, and the Crafted Cardis Highland Single Cut. Also the Etan portion 
Frederick is sporting the Onyx. Uh, the Lingonberry, you can tell it's uh, one of our favorites. And so is the Crafted Cardus, because that's coming up twice as well. So, get some footage here of, you know, classy cans, classy background. Uh, Taboka White, you like that, don't you? No, Frederick? Oh, sorry. You like the Taboka? Uh, I think the Taboka is um, alright. Uh, yeah. I thought... Maybe not all the time, but... This is the only Taboka I haven't reviewed, and I thought it tasted more of um, orange yeah. than the other ones. Yes. Which is interesting. Well, it's pretty good. I mean, you know, when you need something else than the uh, Onyx or uh, maybe the heavy crop cardus. Yeah, I mean, yeah, and the, the Lingonberry works as, a, as an offset against those as well, really. Uh, we just bought Bira Moretti, which is not my favorite beer, but I tell you, it's 30 degrees here. It's it kind of works. And I brought this with me from the UK. So now, let's do it like that, you get better lighting, I think. Which is uh, Cloud Water, double IPA version 3. Uh, it's a new brewery from the UK, Manchester. And they are... That one is now on Rate Beer, rated as one of the best double IPAs in the world, actually. So I managed to get it back home in in England, so pretty happy about that. So yeah, check it out. We're gonna have sunset here, we're gonna snooze and drink beer and be generally pretty pleased. So it's only 43 degrees today. It's gone down from 44, so it's getting cooler. We have something called, yeah, <laughs> what is it called? It's like a, it's like a Afri Desert wind. African wind. Afri a wind coming in from Africa hitting this part of Sicily only. Like, uh, it's like 15 degrees colder on the east coast than where we are, of course. So It's called Sakuru. Or so like that. Yeah. Um, so, it's, so it's like, yeah, straight ahead. So we're, we're ignoring most of what the GPS is saying. We're going to the catacombs of Palermo, uh, which is like burial chambers where 8,000 mummies are to be seen. It should be quite um, horrifying. Yeah, quite scary. We talked to the uh, the woman who has the Airbnb and she said, oh, it's scary, she, she doesn't like it. But that sounds like something we need to see, really. Uh, but yeah, you, you know, we, you can't see anyone walking around in the heat today. It's, it's absolutely insane. 43 degrees and sunny. Uh, and the wind itself is, uh, it looks quite windy, but the wind is, is it, like walking it's into... It's warmer. Yeah, it gets warmer when you walk into the... Uh, well, when you get, it gets windy. So it's like, um, I don't know, it, it feels like walking into a, a windy sauna. <laughs> so it's absolutely brutal. Like so a hairdryer, constant hairdryer. Yeah, constant hairdryer. I think it's, it's the hottest I've ever experienced in my life. Look at the fire. Oh yeah, yeah, look. We've got fires everywhere, and we've heard that uh, Shefalu, where we're going later today, has got a fire in the mountains around it, so we might have to drive through through, uh, smoke. through smoke, really, yeah. So that's the fire of Palermo, we had a fire behind us, we saw as well. And on the left side. On the well. left-hand side, yeah, behind there, and then in Cefalo later. Ah, il fumo, il fumo, il fumo grillo, grillo lasagna, cappuccino. Cappuccino molto bene. Molto bene. Molto bene. El fumo. Okay, we're supposed to go to Cefalo today, but we've been told by the Airbnb host that uh, we might not be able to go. It's uh, the, the highway is... <laughs> it's okay! Calma, calma! It's basically... Uh, Fire all, when we came in from Palermo, there were fires along the motorway. Uh, this is where we're staying. The fire just next door. So it's a little bit of a, an adventure. You can see the fire right now. It's channel, channel up. one. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah, you. Alexi, you saw the you saw the firefighters over there. Second fire, it's there. Oh, it's there. Okay. So we have. That's the first firefighter we've seen. Actually. Crazy hot. This is the hottest I've experienced in my life. It's crazy. For you as well. 40, 40, 42? Yeah, it was 45 in Palermo 45. today. Yeah, 45 degrees in Palermo. 
And you see people are standing on their balconies, a uh, bit worried what's going to happen. The, um, uh, the host of, uh, of the BMB here, very nervous at the moment, uh, almost a nervous breakdown, I think, uh, very nervous about the fire. So we don't know where we're staying tonight. Uh, no time to chill. I'm getting hungry. fires around this area so we're, we're heading now from Bagheria to Chefalu and oh well here still still a bit of fire still a bit of look just, at those hills oh god man so yeah yesterday what happened basically we were evacuated we were evacuated yes. from the B&B where we stayed had to take all our bags and um, just take the car and uh, everyone was kind of panicking the um, the hostess of the of the B&B, she was beyond herself really. Uh, we had to go further down, we were probably like 200 meters away from an oil <laughs> place, like a, they had loads of oil and it was burning, we didn't know it was oil there, so that it could have exploded. <laughs> so we, yeah, right now we've got a smell of smoke in the car. And we got a car in front of us with a lot, lot of gas. Gas! Perfect! Perfect! <laughs> but right now it's only 27 degrees. Yesterday we had 45 and a spontaneous fire is coming from this crazy wind, this Saharan wind that came in. It was it was weird. Now Chefalu coming up. Um, so yeah, bit of an intense day but we we were supposed to go to Chefalu yesterday but couldn't. So we, we stayed one more night in our b, &B. Um, Now we're having contact with the, uh, the woman at the Airbnb we're staying at today and hopefully We'll meet her soon when we get into Chefalo. Is that smoke up there? Yes, the hill? I think so. So, um, so we're coming into Chefalo. We're going to stay here one night instead of two. And hopefully, you can see here. It's just it's been burning everywhere around the motorway. It was closed yesterday. So hopefully we'll stay here. Oh, should oh, I do yeah. that? Uh oh, this is some sort of... How does this work? Telepass, maybe? It's telepass, we don't know how these... Self-service? I have no idea. Just, the self-service. Just drive, man! Just drive! Let's take, this, <laughs> let's take this one. Oh shit, we don't know how this works. We just passed one of these. Have we got any cash? I don't know. Uh oh. Ciao. Ciao. How much is it? No. Ah. Can you pay him? I'm paying. Okay. No ticket. Okay, so ticket first. Uh, so we might have screwed this one up then. <laughs> I don't. I don't M. I've got. Uh, I've got ten. I got ten. Ten. Oh. So. Uh oh. Manual. <laughs> What's going on? It doesn't have change. Nope. <laughs> okay, so you were supposed to take a ticket. Yeah. Um, but we didn't. We just drive straight through <laughs> and this guy is not too happy I think. Okay we screw this one up. But this was the worst area yesterday. Um, Shefalu was basically you couldn't get in because of all the fires. Uh, so it told us don't come but now we're here and it's, it's better today. Are we gonna get past this? How do you say sorry? Excuse. Uh, Excuse. Excuse. So one, one euro or? <laughs> what are they doing? Is it coming out again? Ah, it's taking my uh, registration number. <laughs> Oops. Oh, can uh, get really expensive this one. <laughs> Look out for the invoice coming to Sweden later. Yeah, we're paying. Cash is king. Cash is king. Except here, because a ticket would be king. But ticket would know. be ticket would be better. 
uh, uh. Okay. He's got a Is registration a guy, number. I think. Hope so. Ah. Okay. School, see, school, see. Ciao. Oh, he's letting us through. Hooray! He was cool with it, I think. At least he didn't say mafia. <laughs> well, maybe they're sending the mafia after us now. <laughs> Probably. Keeping it, keeping a track on us. Keep it real. Keep it real. Okay, so it's your father. Sveng till höger. Sveng till höger. Uh, no. No. Ah, two point. 2.6 kilometers were there. Okay, see you guys in Chefalo. Right, bye. We arrived in Chefalo in our Airbnb. Uh, this is the nicest place we've stayed in so far. Cardis uh, in and Etan portion. Why not maximize when, you're, when you can? Uh, bedroom, very nice. Just installing ourselves here. Do have a double bed. Uh, people think we're probably a couple here. But who cares? Okay, so that's our flat. So it's like someone's home they're just renting out on the Airbnb. Very nice. And this is the main reason we picked this place. We got it, whoops, we got a really, really nice terrace here. The mountains surrounds Shefalu, northern Sicily. And that's our view. Might not get a very good sunset today, but uh, you, you can see, you know, try, um, the wind's been problematic here and it's not bad with the wind, but we're still, the weather is not peaking at the moment. The main view though, obviously, this is what we've got with us. Cardus, uh, Crafted Cardus, Etan Lös, Crafted Snooze Whiskey, John Spires Homemade. Caliber Wheat Salmiak, another crafted cardus, Old Wing Fudge, uh, General Loose Onyx, General Macmira, uh, Anno 1852 Cognac Lurs Snus, Mustang Lurs, uh, Crafted Snus Whiskey Original, Etan Portion, Crafted Snus Whiskey White, and uh, that's the General Lurs again, isn't it? Etan Lurs, uh, Old Wing Fudge, Caliber White Salmiak, Wheat Salmiak. Calibre Original, Göteborgs Rapea Lingon, twice. Uh, Onyx, Crafted Cardis, Taboka White, Crafted Snus Whiskey White White, Crafted Cardis, Crafted Snus Whiskey Original, and Crafted Cardis. That's it's a pretty decent collection. I yeah, think. I think I think we should last the week. You think so? You think so? Maybe we should try and get some more in. The local shop. Yeah, we try to find Down some here corner. in Chefalu if we if right. we are if we are feeling low on snooze later. In need, in need. indeed. indeed. So we we'll probably here. Chill, chill here. We heard that one of the best pizzerias of the whole whole region, well, the whole of Chefalu, is just down somewhere. Right down there, I think. You reckon here yeah, behind this down, building? Down on the corner. So we're gonna go and grab a pizza right now, aren't we? Yes, we are, and a beer. Let's do it. Let's bring the snows. Let's bring the snows. Yeah. All right. Hello, check it out. Frederick's just given me a really nice t-shirt. You might uh, recognize the, the logo on that one uh, for my 40th birthday. I'm turning 40 soon. Frederick is turning 40 before me there, luckily. So I'll taunt him about that one for a couple it of days. Is. Beautiful snows, very mellow, uh, very fresh, very light, very well blended with the herbal notes coming through and the fresh, fruity, uh, and slightly tart note to it. Home run, this one. And um, you know what we're doing here. Basically, 
we are snoozing a lot of uh, premium snoozers to go with the premium views. You know, you can't go can't go mediocre when you see this, can you? So for the next review, I bet you will see us in Taormina, which is on the east coast, probably the most famous place in uh, Sicily. Brancione in finale. <laughs> Brancione. Brancione. And now we're heading to a beach somewhere, aren't we? The Oliviere Beach. Oliviere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's an offer you can't refuse. Uh, si, si. Si. Molto bene. Molto bene. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Set sicula var er vi någonstans. <laughs> this is Finland, really. Sicula. Okay, so yeah, it's really cool. This road is just going on and on along the coast. Many countries I've been in, I think the um, uh, the road tends to just go inland every now and then. I think up there you've got the motorway. We're trying to avoid that one. And uh, just heading along the north coast of Sicily. And I tell you, this is a place I would be going back to. There's even a train track, isn't there? The train track is actually going... Close by the sea. Yeah, it's even closer than this. And we get these small villages. We're just entering a village. And we are in the middle of the village. <laughs> and and we are <laughs> exiting the village. This is what it looks like when you got four snoozers in at the same time. Got two... <laughs> two lingon. Göteborg uh, Serapia lingon and two. Crafted snooze whiskey original. So um, that, yeah, that is quite stupid actually. They they even out each other. I wouldn't say they go well together. No, not recommended. Don't don't right. go with a lingonberry and don't do one lingonberry and one whiskey there, and then one <laughs> lingonberry and one whiskey there. Um, Connie, if you see this, don't do that taste combination. <laughs> uh, just so you know, the tip you know tip from the experts here. <laughs> yeah. Oh, more sea, more sea, more sea. You can actually see some some islands over there. Are those the uh, there are islands? Aeol Aeolian the islands or something like that? Aeoli. I yeah. <laughs> Aeoli. Aeoli. Uh, it could be uh, Lipari. Is that up there? Lipari. Lim Limpari. Uh, on the Limpari. On the Limpari. <laughs> well, that's his island. This is island. Yeah, okay. Swedish football player, isn't it? Well, might might be. We are going to the beach anyway. See you there. Fredrik tar det i tvåan. Påhopp. Sen gammalt. Påhopp. If I film here, it's better because then we got, don't get the shit stains so much on the, ah. in the, on the view. Sväng till höger och sedan sväng sak till höger. Is it possible to turn off the sound, you think? Turn off the bloody the voice GPS directions. voice. Can't we get Homer Simpson instead? No. That would be more fun. Unless you can can do him. <laughs> what does he sound like? Okay. I don't know. <laughs> can you do? <laughs> no, no, that's Don Corleone. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll make you. I, I can't. I, can't I will do. make you an offer, and you can't refuse. Turn right. <laughs> oh, that's 200 meters. You turn on the, the, the right. The problem with that is, while you're waiting for him to go, yeah, oh, you've already missed. You missed. You missed the exit. <laughs> you have to wait for the. Oh, and when that's finished, you just pass the. Um, <laughs> you know. You know that turn. when it's when you got 300 meters to the next, then it starts. <laughs> then, it, then it kind of finally, like, okay, get ready. You know, <laughs> yeah. and, then, and then it's like, then just when you've got 30 meters left, he says whether it's right or left. I think the, uh, the uh, actually means, you know, like in 30, mean, in 30 meters. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. like much better than the Swedish voice, I think. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, you just missed it. <laughs> Oh, now we're getting down to the proper sea road again, or whatever. Oh, it's nice. We got a beach down there. Can, can we just look at the fire? What the fire did? I look at that. That's just mental. Sometimes, or uh, still, we get uh, smoldering fires. Like maybe not fires, but still, it's smoldering on the side of the road. And this, this should have been two days ago. Uh, it smells. We 
Beautiful. Yeah, I mean, look at that. It's beautiful here in Sicily. Go now. Just, just come here. Visit us. We'll be here for the next three years. Have a snooze. <laughs> Have a snooze. We got plenty. Uh, I actually discovered I had another five cans that I didn't even show in the in the footage yesterday. Enough, enough to travel to oh. back to Sweden. Oh, it should last us for days. <laughs> I like the color of the sea as well. It's really beautiful. You got that turquoise, right? And it's blue, surprisingly. There. Look at it. Loving Sicily, loving Italy. Oh, 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 o